Hello and welcome to Money Control's Political Wrap. Here are the top headlines of the day. Protest outside Sonia Gandhi's house over Rahul Gandhi's Sikh's remark. Protesting doctors ready to meet with Mamta Banerjee. Congress unveils five poll guarantees for Jammu and Kashmir, offers interest-free loans for women and up to 25 lakh rupees health insurance. Out on bail engineer Rashid vows to fight against PM Modi's Naya Kashmir narrative. And AAP names 21 more candidates for Haryana polls, fields Kavita Dalal against Vinesh in Julana. Now let's get into the details. Sikh leaders from Delhi BJP's Sikh cell on Wednesday staged a protest against leaders of opposition and Congress leader Rahul Gandhi after his remarks on the Sikh community in the US caused a political uproar back here in India. The demonstrators gathered near Gandhi's residence at Tanj Janpath chanting slogans and carrying placards as they attempted to march from the Gyan Bhavan. However, the police intervened and stopped them before they could reach the residence. Several Sikh leaders, women and BJP members participated in the protest with many being detained by the police. Two days after Supreme Court rebuked Kolkata doctors who are protesting against the rape and murder of a trainee doctor in the state-run RJ Kaur Medical College and Hospital have agreed to engage with Chief Minister Mamata Banerjee regarding their demands. This came after West Bengal Chief Secretary Manoj Pant wrote to the doctors on Wednesday and reiterating that the protests are causing inconvenience to patients and their families. Invited them to the state secretariat, preferably with a delegation of 12 to 15 doctors. Responding to the letter, the doctors said they want to send a delegation of at least 30 representatives and want the meeting to be telecast live for the sake of transparency among all parties. Laying out two other important points, they said the discussion should be held in the presence of West Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee and should be centered around their five point demands. Congress President Maligarjun Kharghi on Wednesday announced five guarantees for the people of Jammu and Kashmir, including 5 lakh rupees interest free loan for women entrepreneurs and Rs 25 lakh health insurance per family if the Congress NC alliance is voted to power in the union territory. Campaigning for the alliance candidates in South Kashmir town, Kharghi also said the Congress NC government will give Rs 3000 monthly to the women heads of families, besides promising to restore the provision to give 11 kg grains per person through the public distribution system. Jammu and Kashmir's Baramulla MP Sheikh Abdul Rashid, popularly known as Engineer Rashid, walked out of Thiar jail on Wednesday after being granted interim bail by a Delhi court. Rashid was arrested in 2019 in connection with the terror funding case, received temporary reprieve to campaign in the upcoming Jammu and Kashmir Assembly elections scheduled to begin later this month. Upon his release, Rashid pledged to continue his political fight, focusing on what he called Prime Minister Narendra Modi's failed narrative of Naya Kashmir. He also accused the BJP of using oppressive tactics against him, saying, I am the victim of BJP and I will fight against PM Modi's ideology till my last breath. The Ahmadbi party on Wednesday announced 21 candidates for the upcoming Haryana Assembly elections, nominating Kavita Dalal to represent Julana. She will be competing against Vinesh Pogat from the Congress and Yogesh Bajarangi from the BJP. This announcement marks the party's fourth roster of nominees for the elections scheduled on October 5. The AAP has chosen Raj Kaur Gill to run from the Ambala Containment constituency, while Sunil Bindal will represent the party in Karnal. Nishad Anand is set to contest from Gurugram. Following the collapse of seat sharing negotiation with the Congress, the AAP released its initial list of 20 candidates on Monday. Led by Arvind Kejriwal, the party has now confirmed 61 candidates for the electoral contest. Now that's the wrap for the day.